The Earth's hottest 28 days ever recorded were in July, according to the European Climate Change Service, Copernicus. Scientists say the heat waves would have been all but impossible without climate change. It's why we need to cut greenhouse gas emissions and why gas fires and boilers will become a thing of the past as the world moves away from fossil fuels. Instead, the heating systems in our homes will be electrified and one of the main alternatives is a heat pump, which absorbs heat from the air, ground or water around a building. They're very energy efficient, but take up of them has been slow. Fewer than 60,000 new heat pumps were installed in the UK last year and that is way off the government's target of 600,000 a year by 2028. Our climate editor, Justin Rolatz, looks now at why they're proving such a hard sell. It is absolutely freezing, minus 12 degrees centigrade. Oh. Let's get inside. Oh, it's blissfully warm in here. Look, the lights come on automatically. This is the home of the future. Even the mirror is a radiator. But you can't move in just yet. These two full-sized homes are a laboratory built inside a huge warehouse and designed to test low-carbon heating systems. At the heart of this vision for the future are these heat pumps. Sales of new gas and oil-fired boilers will be banned in 12 years' time. Heat pumps are the front-runner to replace them. Why? because they are so efficient. But there are some drawbacks. Getting a heat pump installed can involve more than just changing your boiler. A lot's going to come out. So in this cupboard, we have an old hot water cylinder. That's been removed completely. The boiler is being taken out. Radiators completely replaced throughout the property. Heat pumps heat water to a lower temperature than a gas boiler, so you may need bigger radiators, and they work better in well-insulated homes, and that makes them expensive. These costs come on top of the typical £10,000 to buy and install a heat pump. There is a grant, £5,000 in England, Wales and Northern Ireland, £7,500 in Scotland. And there is another issue. Electricity is much more expensive than gas, so even though heat pumps are more efficient, they cost about the same to run as a gas boiler, which may explain the slow take-up, but the government says that should increase. The price of heat pumps is coming down, the speed of installation uh, is uh, increasing, and uh, we think that uh, heat pumps with a rebalanced um, uh, pricing system across the energy sector w will become more and more competitive going forward, and I've certainly been delighted with mine. At current rates of installation, it will take more than 400 years before every British home has a heat pump. That rate needs to rise if we're going to hit the government's targets for cutting carbon emissions. Justin Rowlatt, BBC News.